Nou, dit is uh, Steve's werk eigenlijk een beetje. En uh, zoals ik kijk er ook nog een beetje naar, maar het is uh, vooral Steve. Hij uh, mist zijn uh, huisje in Engeland een beetje en daar had hij een Engelse bloementuin bij. En uh, toen uh, wilde hij wel graag mee om de bloemetjes voor hier te halen. En sindsdien uh, verzorgt hij ze altijd. Dan komt hij met zijn schaartje en zijn gietertje en zijn bloemenmest. En dan uh, verzorgt hij voor ons elke dag planten. En daar zijn we eigenlijk heel erg blij mee. Uh, hij is denk ik een jaar geleden hier naartoe gekomen met zijn uh, crew bemanning. En dan moest hij een uh, weekje wachten tot, uh, tot de bemanning hem weer op kwam halen. Toen is hij hier eigenlijk elke week bij ons uh, komen eten. En dat is dus bij de kemel? Ja, bij de prins van de paard. De, ja, ja, precies. Ja, de kemel is een beetje hetzelfde ja, idee. Pant en kemel. Ja, ja. ja. En uh, die heeft het hier zo naar zich gehad dat hij eigenlijk uh, weer teruggekomen is. En nou, uh, denk ik al wel <laughs> langer dan een half jaar hier is. Are you okay with the interview? Yes. Okay, right. sure. <laughs> Can I come on board, Steve? Yes, please. Come yes. On board. <laughs> uh, I'm 73. All right. Old, and uh, I've rebuilt this old boat from uh, over seven years from um, being a wreck. Okay. Uh, when I retired at 65, I bought I bought the boat and uh, rebuilt it, and I've now been sailing it for the last two or three years um, uh, along the south coast of England uh, in the North Sea. This summer I'm going back to England again for a okay. while and then to France, to northern France for a bit. But I'm um, mostly now based here. I'm a member of the club here and so I have um, uh, a, a berth here uh, in the harbour and I, I like to spend as much time as I can here because I like Middleburg a great deal. Yeah, and, and, and what's, uh, what's in this town that, uh, that, that makes you like it? Uh, the people, more than anything yeah. else. They're just really, really nice people. Very welcoming, uh, include you in everything. And there's um, a wonderful um, atmosphere in the town for... Um, There's always uh, restaurants, cafes, bars, there's live music, there are events on. The town organizes a tremendous number of events. There's something on almost every weekend. So it's a very sort of vibrant, alive town. But, but still it is a small town or? No, it's, it's, I, it's, I think it's just the right size. It's yes, big yes. enough to be a, a real town with really good facilities, but small enough for people to know each other still. Yeah, yeah. Um, and here it's very nice because you can be both right in the middle of the town. So I have a bicycle on board and I, I just cycle everywhere. And yeah. I, I understood you're really a regular at the the the, the bit apart. Uh, no, the, the, oh, the, the camel. Yeah, <laughs> the camel. Yes. Oh yes. yes. Uh, it's She even showed me some some flowers and plants that you put in there <laughs> because. <laughs> well, Sophia and I did those between us. <laughs> yeah. And, I, and I'm looking after them at present. So every morning I do my uh, my daily work, to going around deadheading, watering, looking after the plants for the terrace and the. Uh, 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 that, that area, but it's, it's nice because I miss my garden. Uh, yeah. um, I now just have a small apartment and office in England, but I used to have um, a, a, an old English country cottage with a nice garden. So uh, now that I'm, I'm using the boat a lot, uh, I, I, I decided it was best to sell that. I couldn't look after the garden. So I've got a substitute now, I look after the garden here. And you, think, you take a, a bit care of our town as well. Yes. So that's, yeah. that's brilliant, I think. It's really nice. Yeah. Uh, uh, the flowers in the town are wonderful. Uh, as you cycle through the streets, um, Roses everywhere, hollyhocks, things growing everywhere, which yeah. really makes it very. What's hollyhocks? I don't know that. They're the very tall, Club very tall plant with, ah, the, um, with okay. the big, big flowers on. You okay. see them in front of a lot of the houses. Uh, do you used to be a sailor in the, in your? Uh, no, no. no I, I I started learning to sail when I was 65. I've never had a boat. Oh really? Until then, yes. <laughs> so you started living after yes. 65. Uh, that's yes. retirement. I was talking to a lady uh, uh, earlier while I was doing the flowers. A Dutch lady was there washing washing her clothes. And um, she was saying she felt she was too old to learn at 60. I said, well, I didn't start until I was 65. <laughs> oh, that's brilliant. That's brilliant. So, um, as long as you're healthy, you can do all yes, things yeah. like this. And, yeah. and being um, on a boat, sailing keeps you healthy anyway, because you're physically having to do things all the time. Yes. yes. I do all my own maintenance on this boat because of rebuilding it myself. I, I, I know every part of it now. And so that keeps me busy every day. I, I do something. And you stay young when you're in the company of Sophia. Like, oh, yeah. <laughs> well, in fact, they, all of the people at the Kemmel, they're, uh, they're a really good crowd of young people there. They're really nice. Yes. They clue me in a, a lot of things. And, uh, yeah. They're uh, so, real spacious. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Steve, die was ons laatste uh, die naar huis ging, hoor. Yeah, the yeah. last one to leave. <laughs> the last one to leave at the party last time with all the staff. Yes, like the games. Yes, yes, the games. <laughs> party games and things. We did the, you remember the name of the game we did? Spiker poop. Spiker poop. <laughs> <laughs> I'm quite good at that. Yeah. <laughs> Spiker poop. Yeah, yeah. Very nice to meet you. Is there anything you would like to say to the people of Middleburg, or is it good like this? I, I think just keep the town as it is. It's 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 such a it's a beautiful city, 
uh, with a good mixture of, of visitors, local people, and um, wonderful b buildings, wonderful architecture and history. So I think just keep it the way it is. It's, okay, it's, it's a nice place to be. Good to hear. Thank you so much. <laughs> and see you next time. It's my pleasure.